the whole for the last two minutes, I've been thinking, what have I ever owned since age 16 till now that would be better than what you described that's going across the bottom of the screen? I can't imagine anything. There's no there's no car, there's no house, there's no electronics, there's no jewelry, there's no property, there's no trips, there's nothing that I can imagine in my human homo sapien existence that would be better than what you described. Now, what I would like to swap out is the word strong. I don't need a woman that's strong. I'll be the strength in the relationship. I'd like to swap that if you, uh, hopefully the delegation will allow me to swap, swap the word strong with submissive. Interchangeable with cooperative. I don't need her to be strong. I'm strong. I'll be strong for, I'll, I'll be strong enough for the both of us, but I do need her to be submissive, cooperative, beautiful and smart there's nothing greater than to have a strong beautiful smart woman by your side let me go ahead and play this clip beating you down if your lady is beating you down and ripping masculinity from you if your wife is constantly haggling you breaking you down making fun of you ripping away any type of leadership skills that you have you need to get rid of that bitch Uh, he's uh, <laughs> well, I'm back on cam, sir. Hell, uh, he's a little harsh, but he said, There's nothing greater than to have a strong, beautiful, smart woman by your side. And she, and he says, If you're married, if she's doing these things, you need to get rid of her, even if you're married. So, hell went off camera to tell his wife, He's like, He doesn't mean that, honey. He, this is just off stage. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play one more time. Man. Let's play one more time just so we can give a little bit of time. <laughs> Here we go, y'all. If your wife is beating you down, if your lady is beating you down and ripping masculinity from you, if your wife is constantly haggling you, breaking you down, making fun of you, ripping away any type of leadership skills that you have, you need to get rid of that bitch. It's, right. it's, uh, listen, man, ahead, even man. the Bible says, man, the Bible says it best. It's better to live on the corner of a rooftop than with a quarrelsome woman. So this is 100% facts. If she's quarrelsome, if she's stressing you out, get rid of her. But on the flip side, your greatest asset in this world is going to be a submissive feminine woman. Better than any of your homies better than any friend you can have. That's going to be your greatest asset, your best friend. That's going to be the person that you can rely on the most. That's going to be the person who's going to actually give a fuck about what you're going through. That's going to be there for you. There's no greater asset, which is why God made woman as a help meet to man, because no one is better equipped to help us if they're, if they're functioning in their feminine. So that's all I got to say. All right. We'll go to Trey Smooth. What are your thoughts about it, sir? Okay, um, now it doesn't always happen this way, but a woman can certainly make you or break you. And when you have that type of negativity, you can't have peace, possibly. When you go home, it's supposed to be your oasis. Your woman should be ready to accommodate you, serve you, and pour into you. Like I said earlier, like the, I could never, ever come home to somebody that's nagging at me, that's constantly putting negativity into my life. Who the hell wants to deal with that? Like, you got enough stress in the daytime as it is. You are here grinding. You're trying to get it together. you working to support the family and provide for the family. You come back. You don't want no nonsense like that. You can't listen to a woman degrading you or berating you, talking down to you. Like, you, I strongly agree. Get rid of her. because, And I don't care what it is. Um, I would suggest... Even if you feel like you're financially bonded to a woman, cut your losses, cut them quickly, because it's not worth your peace of mind. No matter what you could rebuild as a man, we know how to rebuild. We could start from scratch if we had to. We would hate to, but you'd find it a lot easier than trying to manage. And it, it's like in, it's like being imprisoned if you're with a woman like that. I could never, ever live like that. And I would suggest to any man that ever has a woman less like that to get the hell out of here. Just leave. If you, I don't care what you lose. Just get out of there. Do what you got to do. And I understand 
the um the aspect of you know you may not want to leave your kids and stuff like that but at the end of the day i think it's even worse to be around uh your children when it's that dysfunctional in the first place if she's if she's got that type of energy towards you and she's showing her children how to disrespect a man like get him out of here all right uh go ahead sam let me go so I'm gonna skip what he's talking about about get rid of your wife and all that. I like what you wrote on the marquee going across. It. There's nothing greater than to have a strong, beautiful, and smart woman. I'm thinking the whole for the last two minutes. I've been thinking, what have I ever owned since age 16 till now that would be better than what you described that's going across the bottom of the screen? I can't imagine anything. There's no, there's no car. There's no house. There's no electronics, there's no jewelry, there's no property, there's no trips, there's nothing that I can imagine in my human homo sapien existence that would be better than what you described. Now, what I would like to swap out is the word strong. I don't need a woman that's strong. I'll be the strength in the relationship. I'd like to swap that if you, uh, hopefully the delegation will allow me to swap, swap the word strong with submissive interchangeable with cooperative i don't need her to be strong i'm strong i'll be strong for I'll, I'll be strong enough for the both of us but i do need her to be submissive cooperative beautiful and smart if i had a submissive slash co cooperative beautiful and smart woman i cannot think of anything on planet earth that would be better than that now why that's not happening that's a different conversation but i just want to throw that out there all right, let me go to Sean. What are your thoughts about it, sir? I think all the gentlemen said some really good things. I like how Shan swapped out the words. I would make mine supportive and ambitious if I swapped out a couple of couple of words. But to be honest, just to take a kind of different angle on it, I really don't think it's about him getting rid of the woman. I think it's about the fact that he allowed that to that situation to occur. You let it get to that point. So why are we trying to trying to triage the situation on the back end when he should have done that on the front end? So he can get rid of the woman, but if he's not built a certain way, you can replace her with 10 more women and he's still going to end up in the same situation. I think this is a him thing. You feel me? And, I, and I, I'm assuming most of the guys on this panel wouldn't allow themselves to be in that position. Awesome. Well, no, not everybody. I, I'm a, I'm a fuck up like that, Sean. I, I, my 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 woman, my good woman detector is not all. It needs to be recalibrated. Re what? Recalibrated. I feel you. I see. You with Sometimes they come as a Trojan yeah. horse too. Don't don't forget about the Trojan horse woman. They <laughs> they come in <laughs> come in one way and then it's surprise. All right, uh, go ahead, humble dad. What are your thoughts about it? It's true. I mean, I, I definitely would like to switch uh, switch out the words. It's strong. I mean, it's no reason for her to be strong. I mean, the Bible says she's the weaker vessel for a particular reason and purpose, right? Uh, and I'm with Shannon. I'm thinking about the same thing. Like, what have I had that's better than uh, a submissive, beautiful, smart woman, right? I've had one before, and I'm fortunate enough to have another one, right? And so... My, my day goes different because it's with her. You know what I'm saying? I'm able to plan and line things up in a way that as before I was, even though I had a plan, I, my structure was out of place. You know what I'm saying? Uh, to a degree. Uh, and, and she came in and she's a mother to my kids, which allows me to uh, focus more on um, the other parts of the skill set that I have. Right. Uh, so uh, guys need, to, in my opinion, need to try to find that early. You know, I know other guys disagree, but if, if we're saying that you can reach your destination sooner uh, with a woman such as this, then why wait if you find her? You know what I'm saying? If you have your mission, you have your vision, and you have a plan on reaching those things, then bringing in a beautiful woman that's intelligent too, that means that that's two, because you know two heads are better than one. And then when your sidekick is pretty dope at being able to uh, ascertain what, what your goals are and able to say, OK, say, babe, I don't know about that particular part, but like this part makes a little bit more sense to me. And then you as a leader say, you know what? Ah, OK, what I was thinking don't make sense. But what you're saying is better than what I what I'm thinking. OK, let's go with that. Right. So 
Absolutely, man. Like if you have a dope chick on your on your side, uh, there's there's no way to stop you. I mean, the stats even show it, right? I mean, Shannon can probably speak to it more than I can. The high the high earning man typically is married to a dope chick. Is one that's smart and beautiful and intelligent. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and so if he do, if he doesn't do that, then that's when his demise comes down. I mean, you can you can look at that from a biblical perspective as Samson. He just looked at the beauty. You know what I'm saying? 